Now, esports has absolutely been growing exponentially over the last decade. Now, professional gamers spend a lot of their time practicing their game of choice to make sure that they stay on top of their game best for competitions and events. But although there are those who will play legitimately, there will always be those who want the easy win and will use cheats and hacks to their advantage. And today, we're going to be covering just that. Welcome to Trending 10. And today, we are going to be counting down our personal picks for the top 10 pro gamers who were exposed for hacking in competitive games. If you guys enjoyed today's video, don't forget to drop a like on the video as it shows support for us. And as well, don't forget to turn on your post notifications so you never miss new content from Trending 10 when it goes live on the channel. Alrighty guys, with that all said, let's get right into the video. Number 10. KQLY and SF in Counter-Strike Global Offensive. To kick off today's video of professional esports players who were actually exposed for hacking in the game, we have KQLY and SF who were actually caught hacking in Counter-Strike Global Offensive. Now, this scandal involves very high profile players using aimbots in competitive play for the game. The professional Counter-Strike players KQLY and SF of Titan and Epsilon, these gamers were actually caught using the aimbot software in late 2014. Both teams removed Red Fired, the cheaters from their teams. Even though KQLY used the software for a week outside of competitive context, he was still severely punished for this. Now, this whole debacle actually led to a bunch of other bans. Some were justified and others not so justified for the pro players. Number 9. Match Fixing in League of Legends Now, taking the number 9 spot on today's list of pro gamers who were actually caught hacking and cheating, this one is from the 1919 World Series of Esports. In the finals of the MLG 2012 Summer Championships for League of Legends, Team Dignitas and Curse NA surely shocked the crowd watching. Instead of just a normal match, the game was played all random all mid, which is where each of the players pick a random champion and both teams only play in the middle lane of the map, which the map only has three lanes and a jungle. Dignitas and Curse met before the game actually took place and actually decided to split the prize money regardless of the outcome of who won and who lost the game, and settled on playing a game of a ram. The cheaters were of course found out, and MLG disqualified both of the teams immediately from competing further. No one was officially banned, but the final was quite a disaster for MLG, as they were just trying to put on a respectable professional competition for gamers. Number 8. Azubu Frost in League of Legends Now, for the number 8 spot on today's list of the pro gamers who were actually caught cheating red-handed with hacks and punished, we have another instance of cheating at the League of Legends World Championship in 2012. League of Legends professional Korean team Azubu Frost was actually caught cheating the old fashioned way. They were actually caught peeking at the other team's screen, commonly known as screen peeking. Okay, while they didn't actually look at the other opponent's screens, they did occasionally peek up at the big screens for the whole match, which were actually situated right above them which displayed the locations of everyone in the game. Their cheating actually resulted in a massive scandal and a major fine of $30,000 for the professional League of Legends team. Number 7. Diablo in COD 4 Now, next up on our list of pro gamers who were actually caught hacking and cheating, we have Diablo in Call of Duty 4. It's not uncommon for people to let their friends play on their account. People play on each other's accounts all the time. Sometimes it's just for fun. Sometimes it's to boost and gain more experience, which is also known as cheating. And other times it's to let another player play for you in a Call of Duty 4 Modern Warfare competition. This is what happened to Fat Games, a professional Call of Duty team that decided to pull off one of the world's dumbest cheating attempts of all time. Fat Games actually gave one of their new players, who hadn't even been playing the game long enough to compete, based on league rules, gave them the login details of the player who was replacing them on the team. Now they got caught and turned in immediately. Both Diablo, the new kid, and the person who gave the login details for the account, Stat, were actually banned for 6 months total, and the league deducted major points from Fat Game scores. Number 6. Kid X in Overwatch Now, for the number 6 spot on this list of cheating professional players who were caught and exposed for hacking in game, we have Kid X. Kid X is a professional Overwatch player who is actually a top 200 Overwatch player and high profile streamer on the Korean server. Now, 
Kid X was actually in fact banned for using multiple aimbots in games of Overwatch. However, this ban didn't exactly happen in privacy. Kid X was actually streaming when the ban hammer fell upon him. Now his use of aimbot on streams wasn't hidden at all. Blizzard actually found out almost immediately and went to go shut down Kid X's account midstream. Now we all know Blizzard has an absolute zero tolerance for when it comes to dealing with cheaters and hackers, so we know Kid X's ban is permanent, to say the least. Number 5. Jonathan Kosmala in Fortnite. Now, for the halfway point of today's video of cheating professional players who were exposed in the limelight for having cheats, Jonathan Kosma, who was actually caught cheating in Fortnite Battle Royale. Now, another very popular form of cheating is a hack that actually lets you see other players as well as other items through walls. This is more commonly referred to as wall hacks. Wall hacks are a very particular popular cheat because it's harder to detect than something like an aimbot. Well, that's exactly what happened to player Jonathan Kosmala of Team Caliber when he was using wall hacks during the Fortnite World Cup qualifiers back in April of 2019. Now, Kosmala was actually caught in a really unconventional way. However, the creator of the hack is actually the one who turned him in. The original creator of the wall hack said he did it because Kosmala was taking advantage of a professional tournament worth over $30 million in prize money up for grabs, rather than just using it to have fun on the game itself. Now, Kosmala was later released from Team Caliber, and the cheat creator even gave him a full refund of the wall hack. Now, we're not quite sure we can justify even using hacks for fun, but we have to admit, we have some respect for this hacker's weird code of honor. Number 4. Forsaken in CSGO. Next up on our list of professional players who were caught red-handed and exposed for cheating in-game, we have Forsaken, who was actually caught cheating in Counter-Strike Global Offensive. In one of the most famous incidents in esports cheating history, a member of Optic India's Counter-Strike Global Offensive team was actually caught red-handed at one of the biggest tournaments of 2018 for Counter-Strike Global Offensive. It was actually the Extreme Land 2018 Asia Finals for the game, and the player known as Forsaken had equipped an aimbot on his PC to help him out during this game. Tournament officials quickly caught on to this, and they approached his setup immediately, and Forsaken actually even tried to delete it directly in front of them. Now, needless to say, there wasn't really a question of whether he was innocent or not. Of course, his team was promptly disqualified, and further investigations actually found out that he had also been cheating at ESL India Premiership 2018 Fall Tournament. Now, Counter-Strike Global Offensive already had a bad rep for cheaters, but Forsaken's antics really shook viewers' faith in the esports scene for the game. Number 3. Darksider in Guild Wars 2. Now, for the number 3 spot on today's video of the professional gamers who were caught cheating and exposed for using hacks, we have Darksider, who was caught cheating in Guild Wars 2. In ArenaNet's MMO Guild Wars 2, cheaters were not tolerated whatsoever. One look at the case of player Darksider will let you know that what they meant business. Darksider was a very notorious hacker. He had been terrorizing the MMO's PvP zones for weeks. The player's character was impossibly strong, nearly impossible to kill, and had the power of teleportation. The player was reported thousands and thousands of times before the head of security for the game took control. The head of security actually seized Darksider's account and all the accounts associated with him and humiliated him publicly. He took control of the avatar, walked him up to a very high place where all could see, stripped the character naked, made him wave goodbye, then sent him falling to his death and a permanent ban. Now, there was some controversy about ArenaNet handling their hacker problems unprofessionally, but there's no denying that this was hilarious. Number 2. Semphis and Counter-Strike Global Offensive At the number 2 spot on today's video, we've got another Counter-Strike hacker who was actually caught and exposed for cheating in-game. Now, we're talking about Semphis. Doping is actually more commonly known in traditional sports such as baseball and cycling, which is why it's so surprising to see it pop up in an esports tournament. A few years ago, in an interview with CSGO player Corey Friesen, also known as Semphis, the interview actually mentioned that while listening back on the comms, for Frazen's team, Cloud9 sounded quite funny. Frazen then went on to admit that he and the entire team were on Adderall to help them focus up at the ESL1 Catalyst tournament in March of 2016. Now, while specific actions haven't been taken against the team, as of the ESL handbook didn't mention Adderall specifically, it was still technically illegal. The incident, however, did open up a full important conversation about performance enhancing drugs in esports and was even warranted for an article in the New York Times. Number 1. 
life in StarCraft 2. To conclude today's video of the professional players who were exposed for cheating, we actually have Life, who was caught cheating in StarCraft 2. Back in 2013, Lee Life Sin Hoon reached new heights with an unprecedented win streak of tournaments in StarCraft 2, and he was also the youngest player ever to win a GSL tournament. Well, that all eventually came crashing down for this pro player. However, when he was exposed for involvement in a large-scale match-fixing scandal in 2015, it was discovered that Sun Jun Mo, a former player, host, and journalist, was paying life to throw matches. And then he would go on to bet on those matches in order to turn a profit. Sin Hoon was sentenced to 18 months in prison, a three-year ban, and the equivalent of a $64,000 fine, he received a lifetime ban from any KESPA tournament. Performing acts that are illegal within the rules of a game is one thing, but when you venture into real life fraud, you face real life consequences. Well guys, that is gonna conclude our list of the top 10 professional gamers who were actually caught cheating and hacking. If you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure you drop a like to show your support for the channel. Well guys, with that all said, I'll see you in the next one.